みなさん、こんにちは。お元気ですか So,、uh, let's review what we've learned、uh, the previous session. Alright? 私はスマホで YouTube を見ます。スマホ、スマートフォン。Alright? So, we shorten the word like this. スマホ。Okay? 私はスマホで YouTube を見ます。To watch or to see. What do you see? What do you see? YouTube, right? I mean, YouTube. YouTube を見ます。What do you see? YouTube を。スマホで。What do you use to watch? What do you use to watch? スマホで。Alright? So,、uh, 質問です。I'm gonna ask you a question. 質問です。あなたは、あなたは、お箸で、あなたはお箸で何を食べますか何を食べますかあなたはお箸で何を食べますかチャップスティックス。お箸で何を食べますか ?Let me know in the comments below.Alright, so,、uh, this, で、お、these are important to、uh, go to the next new vocabulary. Alright, so,、uh, you have a purpose to watch something, right? So, what do you watch? What's your purpose? YouTube, right? And what do you use? What do you use to watch? Then, smartphone, smartphone, smaho, smaho de, buy smartphone, watch YouTube. Okay, so this is this,、uh, this auxiliary verb meaning. Okay, well, this is a new word. 新しい言葉です。あげます。あげます。私はあなたに、私はあなたにペンをあげます。どうぞ。Here we go. あげます。So, to give, to give something. What do I give you? Pen this. Pen o Pen o agemas. To who? To who? あなたに To you. わたしは Alright? So, わたしはあなたに Pen o agemas. どうぞ There you go. Here we go. どうぞ Agemas. Well, it's a Christmas day. So, what do you give? To someone in a Christmas day. Well, 私は私は母にケーキをあげます。母 mother, my mother. 私は母にケーキをあげます。Because it's a Christmas day or her birthday, right? 私は母にケーキをあげます。あなたはあなたは母に何をあげますかあなたは母に何をあげますか ?What do you give to your mother? Let me know in the comments. Well, now it's a three o'clock. Okay? 私はあなたにケーキをあげます。At three o'clock. Okay? So, what if I'm talking about、uh, this fact. 私はあなたにケーキをあげます。On 3.05. It's already the past thing, right? So, あげます。Mask form, right? Do you, remember, do you still remember? You can conjugate to the past tense, right? ます、ました。ます、ました。ます。Is a present or a future form, right? A future tense, right? And mashita is a past tense, right? So I'm talking about, now I'm talking about this fact as a past tense. So, watashi wa anata ni keiki o agemashita. Agemas, dozo. It's the time passing, then, agemashita. 私はあなたにケーキをあげました。Right? Well, 
Wow, it's a birthday. Then we are talking about what, what we are going to give. Okay, so we can conjugate this. Agemasho. Agemas to give, right? Masho, do you remember? Masho is kind of like a suggestion or uh, in the future tense. This is a future tense. But agemasho is suggesting or uh, like it's kind of like let's do this. Okay, let's to give. Okay, so watashi wa David san ni keiki o agemasho. Watashi wa David san ni keiki o agemasho because it's his birthday, right? Well, watashi wa Justin san ni mizu o agemashita. Now I'm giving a, a can of water, a cup of water to Justin. Agemas. Watashi wa Justin san ni mizu o agemas. Dozo. Because he's thirsty. Now the time passed, then it has to be conjugated to the past tense, right? So, watashi wa Justin san ni mizu o agemashita. Because he was thirsty. He was thirsty. So, watashi wa Justin san ni mizu o agemashita. You can also say that, right? So, uh, as long as this something has to be something you can give, right? Something you can hand over, then you can say uh, anything, okay? Well, this is the question of the day. Anata wa dare ni nani o agemasu ka? On the Christmas day. On the Christmas day. The Christmas is closed, so you gotta be uh, thinking, you gotta be thinking what do you give as a Christmas present to who? Alright, let me know in the comments. Alright, anata wa dare ni nani o agemasu ka? Who? To who? What? Okay, so let's summarize. Wa ni o. There's three auxiliary verbs, right? Wa is uh, showing the main topic. Okay, anata. You. You. So you are. You are the main topic in this sentence. Okay? And to who? Dare ni. Ni is showing the destination to someone. Okay? And o, what? What do you give? What do you give? Okay? When you give something, there's, there's have to be something, right? So this O is showing something. Okay? So if you have any questions, you can also comment down below as well. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Arigatou.